would you be looking to reintroduce the short selling ban if market volatility picks up from here? The market has been doing well. Is that a consideration? Um, when we initiated the measure last year in March, that was the event that no one expect and the market has been react quite uh, drastically. That's why we come up with that kind of measure. In this kind of situation, I would say that it would be very unlikely that we will going to initiate the same measure like we did last year, because nowadays uh, all the information has been digested. Investor has been understanding all the information, and I think they have been they have been react very well. And you can see from the stock market movement that nowadays the volatility has been reduced significantly. So um, it is very unlikely that we will uh, reintroduce that kind of measure again. So you do not think a situation like GameStop, given the rise of the retail investor, uh, not just in the U.S., but globally, uh, ASEAN included and your country included, uh, would distort market valuations, price discovery, and that would raise concerns for reintroducing this measure? I would say that um, we need to look into uh, the way that the price move and the volatility in the market together nowadays. And from what we have seen uh, in that uh, exercise uh, and that situation, I would say that um, at the moment in Thailand, we have been doing quite okay because for our cash market, we have a restriction on the amount of the short sell that each stock can be short sold. And also in the derivative market in Thailand, the leverage ratio and the instrument that uh, investor can use to uh, speculate, we have less than what in the US market has. So in a good way, I think uh, the situation like that would be quite uh, unlikely to happen here.